those pesky kids and their fireworks always ruining my peace of mind diwali is 3 months away that was just lightning oh um well with my scientific mind i can tell you that fireworks and lightning are very similar they are both loud bright and sometimes colorful of this guy and his science but have you ever seen anyone lighting a storm to set off lightning strikes no right Okay, that was scary. Amidst the stormy chaos, small particles like ice, dust and gas molecules within the clouds clash into each other. The friction during the clashes ends up building static charges within the giant clouds. Show them your shock machine. Oh yeah, my Van de Graaff generator. This ball of static charges is very similar to clouds during storms. When switched on, it creates friction within and builds up static charges. The positive charges travel up onto the surface and this happens. Wow. The positive charges are eager to pounce onto uncharged surfaces like this one here. So, the spark you see is just positive charges jumping between surfaces. The same thing at a larger scale is happening in the clouds. So far, we know what is causing the friction. Once static charges are created, the positive charges journey their way up and the negative charges settle at the bottom. These charges are eagerly waiting for the closest uncharged surface. Here the uncharged surface would be Yes, the surface of the earth. So when the cloud gets anywhere close to the earth, you see a quick zap of lightning, a large scale static shock. The bright white shock is so violent that lightning bolts reach temperatures 5 times that of the surface of the sun. Similar to lightning strikes, there's a reason why the sun appears to be a giant white ball of light. It turns out when any object heats up to very high temperatures they undergo massive changes at an atomic level this results in the object radiating a glowing white light and this is exactly what lightning bolts predominantly are bright streaks of white light but I'm sure you have also noticed that some lightning bolts are bordered by different hues some blue some yellow red and even some purple now where do you think these colors are popping in from figure this out and let me know in the comments below Psst. here's a hint it's very similar to how fireworks get their color so in a strange way lightning is nature's own firework ah Like I always say, nature never fails to mesmerize me with its wonders. To learn more about the science behind such cool natural phenomena, get on to the Baiju's app. We love science over here.